morning everybody from Helsinki, Finland. So last uh, last little last night, not last night actually, yesterday we arrived in Helsinki. So we flew over here. Alex got me a trip to Helsinki for my birthday present, which I am so so grateful for because I've been wanting to come back home for a while already. I've missed all of my friends and family, etc. I don't know. A lot so I really wanted to come back and I've really really been wanting to visit Helsinki in the summertime so June July for so long now because it's just it's just the best time of the year to be visiting and we got super lucky the weather um, yesterday was just amazing it was literally warmer in Helsinki than in Munich yesterday it was like 30 degrees so so beautiful and today it looks just as good so very very lucky and it's just it's just such a beautiful city in the summer it's like a hundred percent if you ever come to finland or go to any other scandinavian countries i'm just saying like summer is the way to go and yesterday was just so amazing we were out with my friends we were at a amusement park actually at Linnanmäki, which is just a really old kind of amusement park been in helsinki forever of course not all the rides are old they uh, renew them or put in new ones all the time actually but yeah we went there yesterday and I think we came home around 10 30 p.m and it was still light as day you know it really felt like it was 4 p.m or something it felt so weird to come back to our hotel room and have to go to sleep we were tired but it just felt weird because it was so light outside and that's the best thing about summer in finland because it's so so light for so long and i just love it it's such a beautiful, beautiful city this time of the year. Anyway, I'm going to bring you guys along with me to our little Helsinki trip a little bit, show you around a bit. And yeah, I already worked. So we woke up at 7 a.m. No, well, 6 a.m. Kind of got out of bed at 7 a.m., let's be honest. Had some breakfast and then we came back to the office to work a little bit. I just did an interview for a um, German podcast by Sophia. I think it's called Sophia's Happy Place, or podcast might be something different. Anyway, she interviews uh, business owners who have a business in the area of like um, sustainability or natural cosmetics or anything like that. So she interviewed me, so that was quite fun. I'm always nervous doing my interviews in German though, but I think it went quite okay. And yeah, now it's 10 a.m. and we wanted to go to the gym as well, our, our, our hotel hotel has a gym in it so we're gonna go there right now so yeah let's go have a fun day let's go have a fun time in Helsinki <laughs> okay guys it is now half past 12 let me put it up you a bit Ooh. Um, still don't have any makeup on. I did take a shower after the gym. I didn't film too much in the gym. I thought I would because I thought it would be quite nice and quiet as a hotel gym usually doesn't have like a lot of people. Um, but the gym they have in this hotel is partnered with a gym chain in Finland. So it's a public gym as well. So it did have quite a bit of people and I just feel uncomfortable filming when people are, people are there and exercising, you know, they might not want to be in the camera, etc. So, you know, they didn't film too much but it was it was a nice gym like also because of that it was a really really good gym like it was literally better than the gym that we go to in germany which is which is already pretty good so it was a really nice workout and then i showered i'm still in my hotel room so sorry that you haven't still haven't seen much of helsinki but doing a lot of work here i have a pretty important deadline for today which unfortunately i have to work on instead of go outside and enjoy the beautiful weather here in helsinki you know it's so hard sometimes to just accept that but i have a deadline and i need to get it done and i have a te telephone conference very soon so i got myself a subway because i'm hungry you know this holiday has started out so well so healthy <laughs> but they had a vegan subway which germany to my knowledge understanding does not yet have and finland literally okay if you're vegan come to helsinki it is such a vegan mecca anywhere you go there's always a vegan option it doesn't matter and they're so vegan friendly even at the subway when i ordered the vegan sub she asked me she had uh, gloves on as subway workers always do which is great uh she asked me because she said she just had just previously touched meat for the other customers she was like does, does she want me to change her gloves 
and I was just like I was shocked from the question because I was like wow that's like so considerate and I just obviously I was like you know what it's not that big of a deal don't need to change your gloves but very considerate very vegan friendly like I've said that before when I was here but last time I was here first of all I didn't go out that much like to places and I think the vegan options are getting here like so much better there's just even here the hotel um takeaway menu um has a vegan option here which is just called vegan it's seitan um balls so oops, let me put that back in there so i'm just like super impressed so go finland come here but yeah i'm, I'm surely gonna show you um helsinki very soon i just have to work first <music> we're finally walking around Helsinki we actually came here with e-scooters which is a total thing now in Helsinki it wasn't when I was here the last time there's so much fun I'll show you guys it's so cool everyone's just riding around their e-scooters or like you can rent an e-scooter kind of like a city bike but a city e-scooter and now we are in front of the white church which you can see behind me that's like the landmark of Helsinki basically and it's just so so gorgeous in the sunlight as well absolutely in love it's such an amazing weather like honestly anything is more beautiful when the weather is good but i'm just yeah helsinki is just absolutely gorgeous in this amazing weather so beautiful so yeah we're just um lo like not lounging we're looking around a little bit and then we are going this evening to my brother's for some dinner and then afterwards we're meeting my friends for some drinks and yeah I'm gonna bring you guys along as much as I can show you a little bit of Helsinki this is where I lived a lot of my life since after high school before that I lived in Espo another city in Hels uh, Finland and yeah let's have a look around has said hello to you guys for a while i woke up today with the worst stomach ache ever that time of the month sorry but that's too tmi but yeah it took me a while to recover from that it's a really hard time of the month for me always that first day but then it gets better just like half a day and then it gets better already so it's now around 6 p.m and we are at this cool bar, bar, bar that is behind me and it's called the Allah's pool bar which basically means it's a pool bar they built like this outside pool area over here it's really really cool I just showed you guys a little bit of that they have like a natural pool that goes directly into the ocean and then they have like that's really cool obviously right now and then they have a couple of pools um, that are warmed up so it's really really cool and we're just sitting on the rooftop over there having a couple of drinks chillaxing Alex's brother also arrived today it's his first time in Helsinki so it's cool showing him around a little bit and yeah right in front of the harbor area over here and the weather it is just absolutely beautiful as of tomorrow it should start getting a little bit worse again um, so we're just really enjoying the weather and obviously here you can enjoy the weather quite long since it is light outside for a very long time and it's been such an amazing time yesterday evening I met up with my friends and it was just so amazing and obviously I was so in the moment I haven't seen some of them for two years even three years so 
it was just amazing seeing some of them and I just took everything in and we just had amazing discussions and I'm like the luckiest person ever to have such amazing friends in my life. I've, I've known most of them for like over 20 years so it was really really nice. I also met some of my family yesterday so that was like yesterday, it wasn't like too eventful, like it was eventful but like yeah, didn't vlog too much so I'll try to do more of that tonight with you guys, show a little bit of Helsinki. I think I've showed you quite a bit already, it is just such a beautiful city in the summer and I hope you guys are enjoying. I'm having the time of my life. It is so so beautiful over here. So yeah, I'm gonna go back up and join Alex and Lucas and then we have dinner reservations today at 8 p.m. and then we'll see what happens. So let's go. on our e-scooters right now so this is what we are riding over here in Helsinki and it's just a lot of fun it is a bit expensive but a lot of fun just also a little bit of a struggle to always find one for everybody but we'll make it we're in the city center though Having drinks now at one of it's like a bar restaurant. It's called Gap, but it's really beautiful. I'll show you guys in a minute. The lighting is just beautiful. This is like golden light or golden hour here in Helsinki in the summer. It is 11 p.m. You guys, this is amazing. It feels so nice and it's just so beautiful. Having golden hour be so late and it's just funny because like on Thursday, some of my friends at 10 p.m. said that they want to go sleep now, and I was like, how can anyone think about going to sleep because it is still. So light outside so anyway I just wanted to show you guys this um, this beautiful light that we have right now here in Helsinki we just went out to eat as well it was really nice um, it was like a Finnish restaurant kind of had some nice Finnish food um, I'm just saying my friend over there but I'm gonna go say hi to her soon <laughs> anyway it had nice Finnish food and it wasn't like vegan or anything but that's what I'm saying like you can get vegan literally from anywhere so um, you just have to ask them and if they say no well then just don't go there and I asked them beforehand and they said it was fine and they made such a delicious vegan menu for me I was so so happy about that it was really delicious so yeah I'm just gonna go say hello to my friend now because I just missed her and see you guys later Tell you 